Good Monday morning, mamas. I'm Heather Sullivan with Lee Isla Photography, and I'm here for your Monday Mom Minute. And I have an amazing guest today, <laughs> Sarah Wilson with Legacy Style Co. So welcome, Sarah. Thank you for having We're me. We're so glad you're here. And we are going to chat kind of fall family session, yes. right? So you have this really amazing business. I met you through Women of Waco, and then I was like kind of scoping you out. You actually help style families. So like, yes. tell us just kind of what that looks like. Yeah. So, um, my sister has four kids and I had always helped them when they would do family photos. She was always going a million different directions, right? As you do. And she just always was like, I need your help. Like, I don't know right. what to wear. And like, we're going into the field. Like, do I need to wear certain colors and sure. can, you know, and it's just what I did. And I started doing her friends as well. They would call and be like, can you help us? And it kind of just turned into that. Yeah. So what I do is I get to know you, get to know your personality. We pick colors based on where the photographer's planning on taking right. you, what you're wanting to go, your aesthetic, but also basing outfits on personalities within the family. Right. Because these are your memories. Like you're right. going to look back on these and have them forever and you want to look back and see your family as each of the people in it you know right. um and that's fun and I don't think a lot of people do that with picking out clothes for pictures usually yeah um and I can do closet analysis which means you call me we can do a virtual I can come over we can go through everyone's closets and see match from there, there right? you know and what a great money yeah. saver and you're not having right. to spend anything um and then I can also do personal shopping. So that looks like me curating, me getting to know you. Right. We go through, I give you four looks. You pick what you're wanting from it. And I can go and personal shop those for you so that you don't have to. Or I can send you the link so you can just order yeah. them and have them shipped. So, yeah. you know, it, it's I been a lot that. of fun. Yeah, I love it. I, when I started, I was like, okay, so now what is she? Because we met and we kind of chatted a little bit, but mm -hmm. it was like, okay, I need to find out a little bit more about what she's doing. Because when I, as a way to serve my clients, I send out, you know, some some ideas and some tips because yes. there are definitely tips. And then inevitably, you know, that you're going to have families that just show up and Oh, absolutely. You know, and, and, and they don't know. They're just like, whatever. We just we just got dressed because we were just trying to get here, right? Exactly. And so you try to put out tips and tricks, but that's really not, um, you know, I have some strategies and tips that I've learned, but I think somebody that can come alongside and yes. say, look, mom, I'm here to take this stress off of you. Yes. Right? This is what I do. This is what I do well. And I can help you because I always do say start shopping your closet because that oh, is an that's important number one step usually right? because most of the time you can find a piece or two and then we can base everything else off right. of it you know right <laughs> and I think it's a you know a misconception that you just have to go out and buy all new things because a lot Correct. of times if we start with the foundation of what we have mm -hmm. then we can grow that and and make something amazing um and it saves a few pennies right yes <laughs> um but I do love that you also give that personal shopper aspect because I was looking at the levels mm -hmm. that you offer, which I think is great. Mm -hmm. And we'll put your, um, your information on here so that everybody can find you. But you know, there are moms that they're just, they just don't want to deal with it. Oh, like, yeah. they, <laughs> well, you know, you have so much going on, you know, right. I, I always say I'm an aunt, I'm a mom supporter. So I always have that outside looking in and it's like, I, you know, I'm in amazement. I mean, a yeah. hundred different directions. And then you throw in, you're wanting a picture for your memories. Right. And you're like, I don't have time to figure this out, you know? Right. And it's just that less, yeah. you know, one less thing off your plate. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. You, you being able to take the gifting that you have to serve moms. Um, and, and I thought I'd let you just throw out any tips or tricks that you want to. Um, we, yeah. we, you brought some fall colors for I us did, to look at, which I'm excited board. about. Um, <laughs> And, um, also I want you to share because sometimes, um, I want to, I do, I'll probably jump and then jump back, but you know, being able to help mom with clothing and all of that, but you also can help mom if she needs makeup done, correct? Yes. Like that's yeah. an aspect of your business as so well. So I always say that I feel like I was given this talent with styling because I've been a makeup artist for 16 years. Wow. And when you do that and you go on sets and stuff, you kind of have to learn style and you kind of have to pick up because right. there are just times that they don't budget for that and you're doing that, you know? Right. And so it all kind of comes into play. So 
I also do offer, like you said, the hair and makeup. Um, I just think it's a nice touch too because we don't always pamper ourselves. Right. And if you're doing something as big as, you know, a family picture that's going to last forever and pass down to generations, you might as well look your best self and not have to worry about it. And so. if you look and, and feel like you look your best self. Oh, so 100%. I think that's a, um, that is, you know, when we get to a session and the way you feel at your session is actually going to impact how you see your images. Oh, (laughs) because I can think your images look amazing, but if you kind of felt Mm -hmm. off or you felt like you didn't look your best when you see those images, those are the thoughts that go through your mind. And so having all that, (laughs) having help to get there to where you're dressed your best, you're, you're feeling good because your hair and makeup are done. You've been a little bit pampered. So the frazzle, of getting to the <laughs> session is cut down just a little bit because you're taken care of. Um, so I think that's wonderful. And mm-hmm. I love that service. And we're going to plug that, that awesome. information in yes. there because I know with, with you know, I've got my fall family sessions booked and, and booking. And then I know, you know, other photographers are, are busy doing that. So this yes. is the season it to, is. to get some help if you need it. Yes. Okay. So tell us, show us color boards okay. or talk us through so, any tips or anything. Yeah. So I will just say number one tip usually is just don't match match. You right. know, I yes. always tell people nothing looks worse then when everybody is the same color, exactly. yes. you know, and it's all the tone. I was like, go with the color, go with different variations right. of it. it. You think in your mind, oh, that's not going to look good if I have, you know, a light blue and a dark blue. Put them together. They actually right. look a lot better than if you're all in one. It right. gives dimension. Um, yes. So I'll start off with that. But Fall, actually, this year is kind of fun. Um, Typical fall colors, I guess, to an extent. But they actually are popping a lot more. So I'll just show this to the camera. But reds are actually really big this fall. Okay. And a lot of people are, like, popping reds and actually lime green for fall with black and white this year. Um, So it's kind of fun. It gives it a little different texture. Um, And then we have burnt sienna, which is going to be more of, like, a coral orange Mm. but it's a real deep shade of it and it looks really pretty especially paired with the blue they have the parisian Mm. jewel this year is big and pairing that with orange i mean of course they're complementary colors so that always looks good um and then we have the laudan frost it's a really pretty green because it kind of has yeah it has like a blue tint to it so it kind of is more cool and warm for a fall green um, and then, of course, your browns and your tans are always big popular. Right. Um, but that's kind of the main colors of the season. Um, and what I like doing with these is when you're talking to photographers and getting to know what you're going to go, you know, where right. you're going to go. Gonna photograph. Yeah, because right. if you're outside and you're, you know, in fall and you're amongst like a brown wheat field or something, don't go tans and browns. You know, right. like you don't find, want to completely find blend, those right. colors yeah, that kind of pop. pop differently. Mm-hmm. And then... Just kind of some trends that are going as far as like what we're, what everybody's structuring based off of. So we actually have the 20s vibe is actually back this year. And they have little fun cuts that are really cute that are, you know, the box dresses and some sequins are really popular in the fall. Um, The structured blazer is real big Hmm. right now. Um, And also just structured dresses in general that kind of have that box structure with belts and stuff like that. They're really big this season. Um, Dresses are making a huge comeback, right? Yes. We all fought for pants, and now we're no. headed back to dresses. dresses. Yep. Um, bold stripes and ruffles and lace also. And then floral print, which is usually more of a spring trend, but this it's fall has fall been, mm-hmm, this fall is going to hopefully show some more floral. So with the print talk, though, in photography, I think families also get nervous about putting print right. in it. But I always say, even if you have one person in a real right. big, bold print, don't do a micro print because you're going to lose, you know, if you do a micro check, you're going to lose all that color, you know, right. all the texture in it. You're, you need that difference. Yeah. And so go with a big, bold print on somebody that maybe has a few complementary colors or merging colors and base the other people off of that print. And, you know, right. I think, we do tend to say small yes. print. As yeah. photographers, we're like, uh-huh. small, let me keep it little. Uh-huh. Um, and, and because we don't, want the visual distraction but in family photos it can be cohesive Mm -hmm. because it can pull everything together absolutely right and and then i know i just thinking of um a 
uh, family from last year, you know, it, they really didn't do a bold print, but the, the little girl's dress was totally the palette for the whole family. Yes. You could see the, the yes. print and the colors, and it really turned out amazing. Mm -hmm. And so that is fun. I do like the um, idea of jackets and layers. Those are yes. kind of fun. So I think layers and accessories are yes. always oh, a great big. idea. I always tell people it's not just about the clothes you pick. Right. You know, it goes down. It really does boil down. It, you're creating a whole aesthetic. Right. And so you're looking at, you know, nail polishes, jewelry choices, accessories. If you do a scarf or a hat or, you know, we don't usually like those in photography, but, you know. <laughs> I do. I love, I actually love the hat or the scarf. You know, I feel like yes. those layers will add, again, dimension and texture to that photo. Yes. And um, I, I'm a huge right now hat yeah, the hat thing is like uh, on my radar. I think they're so cute. Um, I did a maternity where she brought her hat, and I had so much fun with that session. See, I was like, this I'm with is you. So I fun. like them. They're great. Um, you know, you do have to worry about the hat hair thing yes. with moms, but but we can always you can always be something you bring and we add in after we do a few yeah. without a hat. So I think that that is super fun. Well, I love this. Yes. We're going to throw your information in there so that they can access your site so okay. that they can kind of get any resources that you might have and also know how to connect with you yes. so that if they're like, "Oh my goodness, we're our fall family session is booked." Yeah. <laughs> okay. And um and so we need it. We want help planning and they yeah. can reach out to you and they Absolutely. can look at what you have available and you can step in and yes. work with them. And that's amazing. Like, I kind of want you like yeah. by my side for the rest of, <laughs> where I'm like, hmm, we need to um, get together more we often. Do. Yes. This is really good. I love this. So is there anything um, that you would just, you know, that you're thinking that you want to throw out any thoughts that you have other than what we've covered? We've kind of chatted yeah, about a lot like, in this little time a lot i'm a big talker so yeah, me too. Me too. Mm -hmm. um, i don't know i'm trying to think about it but yeah i i guess i just want everyone to know it's not a like it seems like an extra cost but it is one of those things to me i work with you i will give you different options different you know because right. to me it's worth it like it's that yeah it's that human touch it's that full aesthetic picture that you're going and you're having forever. So yeah. I think that's one of the main points I always try to tell people because it is a very and I unusual thing to it do. Is, but. It, it is a very <laughs> unique niche. It's, mm -hmm. it's kind of specialized and, w and we're not in the bigger city. But I think what you are providing is peace of mind yeah. and stress free. Yes. You know, I, the, the biggest thing, as much as I try to communicate to families, stay relaxed. Right. It's going to be fun. Keep it relaxed. There is an anxiety yes. going into it session is. and you're trying to get your kids ready and you're trying to get out the door and you've got to do, and it yes. feels so overwhelming that I think what you provide is a really neat option for families, for, you know, especially for moms, because I think yeah. we are the, we're the ones that want our picture taken, yes. right? We're the ones that want those pictures. Exactly. Um, it's for you. I've already, yeah. I've already booked my family session with another photographer yeah. and had to, like, give the heads up to my husband and boys. Like, yeah. this is going to happen. This is happening. It's happening. Um, because I'm the one that wants the photos, but then then it puts that you almost feel that weight of everybody because oh, yeah. you're trying to even you know get dad on board oh, or exactly. kids on board you know all the things and so I think what you are providing is such a special service because it can be one thing that mom does not have to worry yes. about like oh the clothes she's helping me figure <laughs> out the clothes I can get my hair and makeup done I can show up that day and, and just enjoy it and enjoy it a little bit more yes. so and I just love have that. it as a memory too and I always laugh. Some of my clients have called me after and they're like, it was the best because I, my husband didn't fight me. My kids didn't fight me because I didn't pick it out. Right. You know? <laughs> right. Which is, you know, that's, that's very common, too. right? I yeah. About that. You know, like, I mean, you're it's not mom. Oh, well, your you kids know, are the first Sarah one to be <laughs> like, oh, well, I can tell her. But she's like, it's a professional, you yeah. know? <laughs> Sarah picked this out. So, you, you have know, to wear it just today. That, that's, I love that. Is great. That is, a, you know, I love my mom was always like, you can always use me as a scapegoat. Right. And that was our rule growing up. We knew mom was like, if you need a way out, yeah. you just say, my mom won't let me. Or exactly. My mom. And so I love that. Yeah. We can say, it's Sarah's it's fault. It's my fault. Yeah. It's Sarah's fault. You have I'll to wear this it. outfit that you look super cute in. Exactly. Right. 
Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, I love it, Sarah. Thank you so much yes, for joining thank us. Thank you for having um, me. And guys, moms, I know you're going to want to check out her page and her site. So we're going to throw that all up on the video and it will also be in the, in the details. And we are so glad you're here. Go ahead and follow us on YouTube or on Instagram where I send out those little quick clips now. And we look forward to seeing you again.